Hey, this is Natalie from Natalia Style, and today I'm sharing with you my one-of-a-kind show haul. So I attended the one-of-a-kind show last week on opening day, and it runs until December 8th, so you still have one more weekend to check it out, and I want to share what kind of finds I found. I really love attending the one-of-a-kind show because it's really unique, um, you get to meet a lot of artisans, you get to talk to them firsthand, and you can find really unique gifts for the people you love. So here's what I got. So lately I've been obsessed with stationery, and I wanted to stop by the old Island Stamp Company. So I picked up a few items that I can use for either decorating cards or my own stationery. So I got this beautiful high heel shoe. I got this really intricate seahorse. And I got a starfish to match the seahorse. I think it'd be really neat just to create, you know, your own unique place settings or uh, greeting cards. Think, you know, it's just a unique way to kind of um, spruce up stationery you already have. One interesting thing that they were doing at the booth was this embossing technique. So basically what it involves is that you stamp it and then you sprinkle on a metallic powder and then you heat it and it creates this embossed finish. I haven't seen this in a long time, so I picked up this uh, metallic powder and this was about $7 and the stamps ranged in price from $3.50 to $5. Of course they have ones that are more expensive because they're larger, more intricate, intricate, but they have hundreds and hundreds of stamps there so you can definitely find something that you like. Keeping within the stationary theme, I also picked up these recycled book notebooks. So this booth was really interesting. Basically, the woman who owns the booth, she goes to old libraries and she buys up books that are going to be thrown away. And she cuts them up, gives them a new spine so that they're durable again, and puts in blank pages. But what I like about this is that she's not just saving the cover, she's also saving selected illustrations. So this book is Lady and the Tramp, Disney, uh, from 1954, and she has saved a few beautiful sets of illustrations. They were priced pretty well. Uh, one book goes for 23, two for 44, three for 60, which I got. So these are an inexpensive gift that are also definitely one of a kind because I can't imagine finding another book as sweet as this again. One of my favorite parts about the One of a Kind show is definitely the food aisle. I snacked on so much chocolate, peanut butter brittle, everything you can think of under the sun. But what I did buy was this organic gold mustard. So this is the smoked maple mustard and this is completely organic and sourced from Canada. And it has this really amazing rich maple syrup flavor but then after about five seconds whoosh, your sinuses are completely cleared out because there's definitely a lot of kick to this mustard, completely different than anything you'd find at the supermarket. So I'm excited to try this on knockwurst, sausages, all sorts of things like that. And it was under $10, I think it was 7 or $8, I can't remember because they paid in cash. Another great find at the One of a Kind show are all the jewelry vendors. A lot of them are obviously out of my price range, but there are a lot of contemporary designers that have pieces that are very affordable, under $100. And one brand that I really liked was Toodle Bunny. Um, so I picked up, first of all, these acorn earrings. I don't know if the camera is going to pick that up and focus, but they are beautiful acorn earrings and they have these pretty turquoise Swarovski crystal glass, um, glass bubbles and then brass posts as well, so they're safe to wear. And then I also got these tulip earrings. I thought they were really pretty and um, really dainty, so both of these were only $30, which is a really easy gift to get someone if you don't know what to get them. Another jewelry designer that I absolutely fell in love with was Candyware. So the designer's name is Candice Ware and she's kind of pushed her two names together to create Candyware because she designs candy jewelry. So what's really unique about these pieces is that they are actually scented. So this is a birthday cake necklace. I think it was about $25. It comes on a really long chain so it kind of hangs low. Um, and there are also matching earrings and this really does smell like birthday cake. So she is extremely talented. Um, she creates all of these pieces by hand. She uses clay and makes them. And you can also follow how she makes them on her Instagram account, which is really interesting. Um, the second piece I got from her was, uh, well I'm actually missing one of them because it fell on the floor, but these taco earrings. These were only $12 and I think they're so funny. They don't really smell like tacos, but I thought they were really hilarious and really cute as well. The last thing I'm going to share with you is this really quirky gift. So this is by Him Creations, and she creates felt, um, felt works of art, I would say. So she does everything from magnets to little dolls, pin cushions to larger scale dolls as well. 
and this piece was really hilarious. So it is actually a fridge magnet, and I got it because my cat, Moose, has a big fat bum, and she's always kind of getting stuck in places or sticking her butt up in the air. So I thought this was a really um, tongue-in-cheek gift. This was about $38, so it was a little bit more expensive, but a lot of work is involved, and they are completely unique. I've never seen anything like it, and I think it's really hilarious. So if you're looking for a really offbeat gift, I think that's a really good booth. She also had more practical gifts. Um, there were these DIY kits. You could make your DIY felt bunny or a little Russian doll. Um, so it's kind of a good gift for kids if, they want, if they're really creative and they like doing things themselves. Overall, I really enjoyed going to the one-of-a-kind show. I always try to go every year during Christmas time because I always find interesting, unique gifts that you can't find anywhere else. What I really liked this year was that they had a scotch gift wrapping station. So you buy your purchases and you can bring it to them and they can expertly gift wrap it for you. So it's a great time saver or also if you're in a rush and you want to give something right away or you want to ship it out right away, that's another idea as well. Another nice thing they had this year was right when you entered you were greeted by figure skaters. So about three or four times a day they put on figure skating shows indoors and they're actually not skating on ice, they're skating on this really cool silicone mat and they were performing a little dance routine, one did a cartwheel, it was just really exciting and it was a fun way to welcome guests into the show and get ready to get shopping. I hope you enjoyed my shopping haul from the one of a kind show and you can check out more on the blog nataliass.com. Thanks for watching.